Welcome, this is Bob Dust. Today's tutorial is going to show you how to set up your ERD projects for grading. So let's um, start by looking at, this is what we have left over from the previous tutorial that showed you how to do each of the four exercises in the um, um, project one. So you should have this built by now, and if you do, then uh, we're off to a good start. So let's go from here to a grader that I set up, and the address for this is on Blackboard, but I'll type it in here. It is dotnet2.reynolds.edu slash itd130. This is the little grader I wrote for grading some of the projects in the ITD-130 course. Don't worry about the login for now. Some of these features are not quite working correctly, but this will get us started. Click on the ERD projects, and you see we have one here for the SQLDBM. This is the project over here that we have. Now, to grade our project, we have this loaded here on SQL DBM for your project. Now, the left side, if you scroll down a little bit, you'll see a button called SQL. Let's click on the SQL button. And you see we now have the tables that we had from before. We click on the Save button. And then we click on Generate SQL. Don't worry about all this gibberish here. Just know that it's indicative of what you did in your project over here. Then we click on the Copy Script. Click on the Copy Script button, go back to the grader, make sure we have SQL DBM, type in or click inside of here, and then just paste your code in here. Once you have your code pasted, then click Grade It. When you click Grade It, it shows you over here that we have all the tables correct. We have Um, all the tables are here. We have a grade of 5 out of 5 for each one of these. We have a, and again, it does another check for our tables. Let's have the data types, make sure the data types are correct. The attributes are correct. The PK, which stands for foreign key, uh, primary keys, is correct. And all the relationships are right. If you did everything correctly over here, then this grade should be indicative of your work. This says you got a grade of 75 out of 75 possible points for a percentage of 100. Now the other thing I want to show you is, going back to our diagrams, there's a button here called Share Link. For now, until I finish the grader to get it working completely, Click on the share link button and push in a, a URL address for your project and click copy. Once it says it's copied, you can then paste that into your project for Blackboard. And eventually I'll have it set up so you can paste it in here and send it to me that way. But for now, just copy your your SQL DBM project, go to Blackboard, oh, I don't know my password, okay, forget that part, go to Blackboard, and go to the project for, go to the project for project one, so let's go back to our SQL 
DBM. And let's get rid of that. And let's just see what happens if we, for example, uh, misspell the name of our course. And we made it course with a D by mistake. And we click save. So now we don't have the course spelled correctly. Go back to our SQL. Click on generate SQL. Copy script. See it was copied. Come back over here. We'll paste our new code in here. And we do grade it. And now we see it affected our grade because now it says it cannot find the course table because we spelled it incorrectly. And it also says we have some, some tables missing. It doesn't recognize the course with the D table because we spelled it wrong. So it says we have some missing missing um, tables over here. So we get, don't get credit for that. You can see as we uh, make our changes, this will come in here and verify that what we have done is correct. We come back over here. We realize we spelled it wrong. We double click it, take off the D, hit save again, go back to our SQL, run the, generate the SQL, copy it, come back over here, click inside of our text box. I hit Control A to select everything, and then Control V to Copy it, check the grade it again. You can run the grade as many times as you want. And as soon as you are finished, then send the link to your SQL DBM to me via Blackboard. And that's all there is to it. This is a work in progress. I have, this is the first semester I've done this, so maybe a, a few glitches in here. Uh, and I'll be modifying this, enhancing this as semester goes along. So I hope you um, can see how we're doing this. And I'll get the link to Blackboard set up uh, soon. And you should be good to go. So again, this is Bob Dust. And uh, until next time, take care.